How's it going, everybody? Bob here, playing a horror game called The Pendicant Creature. Well, I have no idea what that is, but based off real folklore, so let's see. Oh, I love that sound effect. Alright, so this is going to have some intense music, I guess. What the? The Star Wars scroll to start? Interesting. What does it say? Location. 76 miles away from Long Creek County. A short investigation on the history of the Smithmans reveals that in 1876, they were involved in the excavation of many historical sites in Pajekent. Tajikistan. Tajikistan? I've never heard of that place. Their descendants are still in possession of some of these artifacts that were uncovered from these excavation sites. As a passionate archaeologist, you have contacted one of the only remaining family members to share what you know about their strange findings, and to finally see one of the artifacts with your own eyes. Oh, okay, let's go see this artifact. Pajakistan? Huh. What the? This is, now this is an intro. I like this. We're driving. Cool. <laughs> I don't need to zoom, dude. I'm listening to the radio, driving in the rain. We're heading up to see an artifact. Let's go. Let's go see that artifact. How about it? Let's go. Um. All right. Why do I feel like I'm like in the jungle? This is a thick forest. Where are we? Hello? Pulling over. Do I have anything in my car to take with me? No? Time to get out. Open the door. Do I have arms and legs like full immersion the whole time? Or is that just the one thing? Oh! <laughs> I like that. I got a body. We got a body. We got some immersion. Okay, I can sprint. I got a little hop. Oh, I actually got shit. I got no arms. Where are, my, where are my arms? Seems my arms have fallen off. Well, um, it's okay. The farmhouse. Smithman. All right, Smithmans. Let me see your whatever it's called. Very nice soundscape, man. I just kind of want to hang out in here and relax in the rain. Always reminds me of summer nights in the rain, sitting on a porch, enjoying it. One of my favorites. Alright. I'll knock on the door, I'm just looking. Alright, anybody home? Hello? <laughs> I love that arm. Hello? I knock. Anybody home? Hello? What is his face? <laughs> He looks like Frankenstein. <laughs> All right, come in, young man. You are tripping, bucketing down outside. Does it always rain so much here in Louisiana? Of course it does. Louisiana is the swamp state. Quite a long drive to get here. I don't think I came across any other farms in the last few hours. Okay, lady seems a little strange. Come take a seat in the kitchen. I will, but I want to explore your house first. This place is weird. What's with the weird pixeling? I feel like I'm in, like, Minecraft or something. Everything's made out of voxels. Very interesting. Why do you have so many pictures of musicians? This is old. Full of memories. See that. This lady's face. You have to be so angry? Alright. Oh, yeah, look at this cat. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Alright, I'm taking a seat. Relax. Chill out. You don't have to make weird sound effects at me. Okay, what? What are you gonna show me? Would you like some coffee or black tea, young man? Hmm. I'm a coffee person myself. Coffee, please. Are you wearing a black robe? Are you gonna, like, sacrifice me to Satan or something? What? Could you tell me more about this mural that we've talked on the phone about? Why was your fridge light red? And what are these weird sound effects in the background? My great-grandfather first uncovered it in an excavation site in Central Asia. 
That was a long time ago. After all these years. Why do you want to see it? No one else has, that's why. Well, Miss... Dirtha? Dirtha? This is what's great about my job as an archaeologist. We discover new things constantly. This artifact that you have... It's a lot older than you might think. It is likely painted around the 6th century. I believe it may be part of an ancient Tajikant murals in Tajikistan. I don't know that much about it, young man. The pieces of the mural that you have might be over 1,300 years old. That's pretty cool. What your great-grandfather found was likely one of the earliest known murals in that area. Doesn't that mean it's worth, like, a bazillion dollars, dude? It depicts mass hysteria caused by a creature from the Sogdian folklore known as a biggin. Wait, a, a biggin? It sounds like what Miss Marvel says when she grows her hands. And biggin! A big, and a biggin. E biggin. A uh, biggin. Okay, what the fuck is Sogdian? Alright. Something gonna like jump out and attack me or something? If you, give, if you give me the permission, I wanna take a closer look at it in my own research. All that mural did was bring bad luck to the family. Uh oh. It's upstairs in the attic. Come with me if you wanna see it for yourself. Yeah, I do. Let me see. Let me see. I'm so curious. It depicts mass hysteria from a demon from folklore that I've never heard of. Alright. Nice little lamp you got. Here, the way to the attic. Probably a bit dusty up there. Can I take this? My great grandfather used to keep his notes in the old journal. Okay. You sitting up there alone? Take this lantern with you. If you need anything, let me know. Okay, I guess I gotta go up here alone? I don't much like that, but okay. No problem. Oh. <laughs> We're playing Amnesia the Dark Descent. What the? A safe? Oh, it's got a code. Uh, symbols, I see. Okay, okay. Symbols. Okay, I need to find some symbols in here. Hmm, what's this? What did I do? Turn the power on or off? Oh, here we go. Symbol. That's a symbol boat. Ah, now where's this painting? A lot of stuff up here. I feel like I'm in a library of Minecraft. There's a lot of stuff. I think I found it. Alright, what am I looking at here? What's up? What's on the painting? I need to figure out a code for a safe, maybe? What's happening? Oh, <laughs> I thought it was melting for a second. Alright. What am I looking at? Like, Cthulhu? Okay, so there's some kind of demon and a bunch of people dancing around it. What I see, anyways. Not quite sure, though. Fascinating. Now, where's his journal? Isn't it locked up? Right? Or is this it? Oh no, okay. What's in here? Journal? Ah, here we go. Undercut. Open sesame. Okay. Yeah, here's the journal. What are you gonna tell me? You tell me, old man. All right. Excuse me. I can barely make that out. There's a circle around one of their heads. Why do they look like they're all wearing masks and like weird white hats? I'm not sure what that says. Yeah, okay, here we go. There's a man in a cave with a torch. There's the symbol. Let's see it is dead. Okay, let me check something. What the hell is that? Hello? What the? What the? 
Oh. What to say? What the fuck is that cube? <laughs> now what am I looking at? Okay. Okay. Is he Tomb Raider now? Gonna match things to other things. Is the pitcher gonna? Ch the demon in the pitcher's gone. <gasps> cool. Where is it? I just noticed that. Interesting. Very. There he is. He's watching me. Okay. What am I looking for though? Okay. Oh. I move. <laughs> So there. Why did it get so dark all of a sudden? Are you gonna... Yeah, I know. I can see the eyeballs. I saw that like 10 minutes ago. Hey? Who's that? What? What the... F you looking at me? What's going on now? Hello? You wanna be friends? Give me a hug? Kissy kiss? Hello? I'm actually confused right now. <laughs> I thought I was supposed to solve that, that safe, but now all of a sudden I'm trapped in here with like a... What is it, a Minecraft spider? Where'd you go, bud? Why do I have a lighter now? Why do I have a lighter? What happened to the lamp? Okay. There's something I gotta light on fire here? Hello? Go see that thing. Aw, oh, you broke the power. How could you? Okay. There's no way I'm dead. Right? Minecraft spider killed me? Oh, did he kill me? Couldn't have. No. I like that painting though. It is creepy. I will say that painting is actually kind of creepy. It's got some bad vibes, I will say. Oh, this was a this was a cool little game. I enjoyed that. Hey, camp team, you guys killed it. That was great. But at the same time, there's a secret in that safe. Yeah, two clues. Opening the safe unlocks new areas of the house. And you can even even result in completely different endings. The full combination is hitting in the top right corner of the home page, just in case you can't find all the clues. I found all the clues though. So square, square. You know what? I'm gonna try one more time, just just for fun. Just to see if I can figure it out. I want to open the safe and see the ending. I want to continue the horror game. Alright. So, continue from the attic. Go. So I found the clues already. So let's see if I can make it make sense now. So there's two on the walls. And this gave me that and that. Okay, so what was this one? There's a symbol right here. Three lines. Oh, three lines. And and T. Am I stuck? <laughs> All right. So what's this damn code? I want this different ending. I know there's a square in here. No. Ah, there we go. Alright, so I was pretty close. Gun? 
Oh. Well, I wasn't expecting there to be a gun in there. Do I have a limited number of bullets? Does that mean I can kill the monster now? Ooh, okay, let's do it. Let's see. Click left F fires. And interact with certain models by shooting them. Look at these. How come you're not letting me go back here? Oh, I missed. I missed the two that were at the beginning there. Okay, let's do this again. Gotta go, gotta do it again. I think you gotta shoot those two things right away first. You have to like destroy these little symbols, but why? All right, let's open this back up. And let's shoot these things. All right, what was this? That was square. This was square. There you go. Okay, shoot the thing this time before I go up there. What a random thing to add, though. Like, why a gun? I'm so confused. It's kind of like a Resident Evil, shooting those, uh, the hidden, uh, statue things. That's one. Another one. Okay, that turns the power on. What about these ones? Oh, I know this is one. Okay, is there another one in here somewhere? Right? Maybe? Or do I have to wait for the scene to change? Hmm. Could be. Very weird. I don't see anything else hanging to shoot. No? Well, I've shot two things so far. Let's see. Let's see if this gets any different. I'm hoping for a different ending here. I open the safe. So, change it up. The creepy painting. It's kind of creepy, I will say. A little bit unsettling. I may say so myself. Alright. Okay, is there any more hanging things around now? Do I just shoot the painting? What the fuck? I didn't do anything yet. Okay. During this scene, maybe? Okay. Anything hanging I can shoot now? This changed up just a little bit. Wait. This is different now. I didn't use the projector. Now what? Do I have to shoot it? Or... Am I just going to die again? If I die again, I'm going to be pissed. Shot it. Did it work? Hello? <laughs> well, oh, something happened. I got a different ending. So I, sh I broke two talismans and I shot the thing. Is it dead? Did I kill a demon? Please tell me I did it. Huh? I'm escaping! Freedom! Yes, alright. Dope. I got this man free. Go home, dude. Stop researching strange... I don't know. Demon paintings? I'm gonna summon Pazuzu. And I'm gonna have to deal with the exorcist all over again. And what are you gonna say? Here we go. Long Creek local. Old woman found fatally shot in her attic. 
So the woman was possessed. Ah. So this or this man is just a murderer. It was horrifying. Whoever murdered that poor lady cannot go, cannot get away with it. Oh no. This man went crazy and killed an old lady. That's that's rough. That's super rough. But hey, very cool. I enjoyed that there was an extra ending with like little clues and stuff to find. That's awesome. Clearly, I gotta play more of these guys' games. See, they, they're, they're killing. Very cool. I will. Well, I always leave the games in the description. If you wanna give this one a try, do it. It's fun. Definitely worth a play. Especially if you wanna play in the dark, put on some loud headphones. You might get a little bit spooked out. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like and a comment and subscribe for more. It really helps out with the Forbidden YouTube algorithm. And of course, thanks for watching. As always, Obi-Wan here, and peace out.